new passwords, amazing commentary by yours truly, a comic book, a secret gift code, and a special new Discord channel for cool things just like this all ahead. Use code Berserker on my games to directly support my channel's Monday giveaway. Thank you so much for your support. Let's get into the video. All right, check your hangers because it looks like we have another event today. Destroy enemies, robots using evil life robots. I've met someone who agreed to leak old evil life documents for me, an unpleasant type, but I've had to work with worse in my field. I've compiled a new archive. You can find the password in your commander UI, launch it and you'll see it right away. Let's check out this commander UI password. All right, password, Oh, So our very own more dingy made this Google Docs here that actually has all the notes of these events past. So we will be using this for the code words and to complete our steps. If you wanna have access to this, join the Discord. Let's get those codes in there. First code, boom, oh! Second code, there is so much more in here. Oh man, there's so much to unpack. Let's do it. Starting with Soren from the Neo Tortuga Brokers Archive. Pilot profile, Soren DeVos. Call sign, Rampage. That's what I'm talking about. That's a cool call sign right there. Age 50 plus. This dude, origin evil life. Freelance pilot, field doctor. Neo Tortuga, birth. Distinguishing features, horns, red hair, bad temper. Soren DeVos was in charge of Evil Life's gene mod program until his abrupt termination due to allegations of ethical misconduct. Following a brief yet contentious trial, he was banished to Earth. Presently, DeVos operates as a field medic, offering his assistance to various pilot clans. We suspect that he leverages this role to acquire resources and test subjects to keep working on his clandestine experiments. However, our operatives couldn't find any concrete evidence of that as yet. Note, his son, Cormac DeVos, is a renowned robot prize fighter. Both Soren and Cormac deny they have any relatives whatsoever. Interesting. Soren 1 transcript. Ooh, interview time. Thanks for your time, Mr. DeVos. Do you recognize any of these pictures? Yes, that's the cataclysm. Wait, just like that? That info must be classified. I have no reason to keep it hush-hush anymore. I was exiled, disgraced. My research, my practice, all gone. I owe nothing to Evil Life, nor any other corporation. Evil Life probably considers you a walking security breach. I've met a couple of their assassins, if that's what you mean. Poor guys, a lot of them. Very unfortunate. You seem pretty tough for a scientist. And, yes, I just don't care. People ask me questions. I say what I think. Do you have anything else I could work with? I've got Evo life records on the cataclysm in that drawer. Take whatever you need for all I care. The passwords though, you'll have to figure them out on your own. All right. Sorn, transcript two. I've been wondering, what was the nature of your research? I was taking the Evo life mission to its next logical step. Make a new human, bigger, better, stronger. And you've crossed the line. I've never drawn any lines to cross. It's just that when it came to the most forward-thinking experiments, my colleagues were not so open-minded. Sorry if I may, sounds insensitive. But yeah, my horns, horns, tails, mandibles, it's all about taking the best from nature and giving it to people so that they can deal with the challenges that Mars throws at them. And that blue-skinned assassin, Medea Nerum, was she your project as well? No! 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 
That's amateur stuff. Think bigger than just gene splicing. Think starting anew, building new foundations. Think 26 nucleobase DNA. No, just a theory, but an actual practice. What kind of practice? Well, we've created some beautiful things. Chenchi, things you couldn't even imagine. I'm curious now. Let's see what this Evo 26 DNA looks like. When I saw this first, I honestly thought you had to match them. I was like, I don't know what that is, but that's, that's pretty dang cool. Evo Archive. He completed the DNA set. That's what, oh my God, his son. Let's see what this leads to. Oh, it's a comic. Yo, Warbots Universe, Yan D. Showdown. Author, Warbots. Meet Corman DeVos, Evil Life Colony, 2034. He's just playing with his toys. An Evil Life kid who had his whole future predetermined, so you may believe. Boy, still toying around like a child. Got it. Time to grow up. Oh, that's me, by the way. Oh, and they give a little code down here. Let's see what that leads into. All right, let's try out that code that we got from the comic. We go to settings, scroll down in general, give code here, paste it, get it now. Let's see. 150 power cells. Hey, I'm, I'm not going to say no to 150 power cells. All right, back to Soren PNG. This guy, yep, his horns, his red hair, his tusk, all that stuff, his tail, apparently. All right, let's check out this email. March 12th, 2071. John Moreau, CMO. To Mary Ballery, CEO. Subject. Project. Mary, this is huge. You need to see this. I've assessed everything I could find regarding the project, and I am absolutely positive we have to get on board. Year on year, we keep banging our heads against the wall on how to get leads on the home country market, but this has opened my eyes. We need to think bigger. We need to think beyond countries, beyond continents, beyond planets, rather than trying to take on Midgarden on their turf. We could redefine the turf. A whole new vision. A true blue ocean. The universe. Imagine the supplements. And then project name. Might require. Oh, imagine the supplements. Blank. Might require. Or, I don't know. How about the gas giant miners? There are four megacorps involved already. We need to put our foot in the door and be the first FMCG supplier to get access. We don't have any expertise on project name, but I think I know how we can contribute. I've scheduled a call this Friday. Let's talk, John. So they don't have a name for this project. It's just blank project, like project name. I applies in voice next. All right, this is another one, client, unknown. Uh, it's like blank, like the project name. Uh, supplier is Evil Life. The client is Yan D. Location blank 28 West. Date April 5th, 2075. Okay, so Evil Life is buying this, all this stuff from Yan D. They're buying Aquamelt ice water purification tablets, 25,000. They bought Think Fast, a brain function stimulants, 50,000 of those. They bought 20,000 Evil Life, Evil Vitals, which is a universal supplement. They bought a thousand burning heart body temperature regulators. Oh my gosh, they bought five espresso machines. <laughs> okay, evil life. All right. Um, they bought a hundred thousand espresso pods, one water cooler, and 75,000 frozen meals assorted. Thank you for choosing evil life. If you have any questions or concerns regarding this invoice, please don't hesitate to contact us. How professional. Evil Life is just selling this to Yandy. Apparently, Evil Life makes espresso machines, espresso pods, water coolers, and frozen meals as well. <laughs> Comment down below if you want an Evil Life espresso machine. I think that'd be sick, personally. Let's check the meeting transcript. October 6, 2083. Haru Lavina, COO. 2. Mali Mary 
Valerie, John Moreau, Noah DeVos, Umida Corin. Subject, our situation, follow up. Hmm. Thanks for the meeting, everyone. Delighted to see you all alive and well. Here's the follow up to our call. Noah, we're going to die. This is a quote, I guess, from Noah. So Noah said, we're all going to die. Rogue project name, waves will reach maximum amplitude around the evil life shelter within five months. According to our calculations, they will either bury everyone alive or slowly rot their bodies away with radiation. Neither outcome is great for us. Thank you for the extensive and vivid report, Noah. Why is that so upbeat? What the heck, man? Possible solutions. Follow space tech and build an ARC ship, build a Mars colony. Yep, that all that stuff seems super easy. Problem. We don't have a space program. Solution. Midgarden had one before they in Midgard had one before the entirety personnel got wiped out by blank project name, I guess. Rains. We need to search through their facilities. Problem. Blank contamination is at its peak at Midgarden locations. Solution. Put Evo Life's brand new blank away supplements to use. Hmm. Problem. The supplement is untested and may cause unexpected side effects. Solution. John will lead the way. He got us in this mess, so it's only fair he sorts this out. Dang. Vote. Four in favor, one against. <laughs> Problem. John vehemently disagrees with the decision of the board. Solution. Evo Life's brand new mind blank no fear and fire warrior supplements oh we wish you good luck on this mission john we hope you come back alive and save us all cheers that is it they just so they're just putting john in this to take care of their whole problem because he started the mess everyone's in favor of him going except him that's hilarious what a messed up vote all right let's check hugo's notes so Evil Life and four other megacorps were building something that caused the cataclysm. Since it was a joint project and Yan Di was involved, I'm sure they still have records from that period. As much as I'd like to avoid this, it's time to pay a visit to my old home. I need to be invisible, like a stalker on a beacon. Hmm, interesting, all that good stuff. Be sure to join the Discord. Let me know what you thought of that commentary. Uh, I always have a lot of fun with this. I appreciate y'all guys um, enjoying it, and I'll, yeah, I'll try to keep it up. If you want to get 25 kills with me, I will be playing today, and I will help you get there. Your 25 kills with an Evil Life robot. All you got to do is join my Discord, which is uh, linked in the description below, and squad up with me. It's going to be a lot of fun. Hope to see you there. Go crazy, berserker. I killed it. It's murder. Go crazy, berserker. I killed it. It's murder. Go crazy, berserker. I killed it. It's murder. Go crazy, berserker. I killed it.